hello and welcome to this video in this video we'll see why your css file is not working with your html file in chrome or any browser which you are using so first of all let me show you my folder structure so this is i have a folder which name the css and inside this folder if i open it you will find i have index.html and style.css file in the root folder and few images as well so i'll just delete those images so this is how it looks so i have index.html file and then a style.css in the same folder in the root folder so this is my code how my code looks and this is the output that i am getting because so i'll put them side by side so if you see that i have a link of the css file and have a h1 in my body so please remember with this link tag we connect our css we call our css file right and if we go to this style.css file i have write a some property some value for this so i have targeted the h1 and give it a color of red and text align center so it should be color of red instead of black but it is not working why so let me show you that so if you notice i have a link tag please remember to open and close the link tag like that then you can see there is the href and what is my file name it's styles styles dot css but if i see in my folder my folder name is style so there is no s so i have added a s this why the name of the file is wrong and my css is not loading so remember that it is necessary to have the same name of the file that you are including here so it should be style.css so if i refresh it now you can see it has loaded now you can see it is loading so this how it works so now my style has loaded and the reason here is before it was the file name was wrong i has a styles a extra u with my file name so please remember to add the exact same name in your linking file okay so this how we link with this tag and remember this is a looks appropriate the way it is so you don't miss the starting and closing tag and also the style file name should be accurate like it is right now another issue could be that your css file is not loading so in that case if you see that i have my style.css in the root folder where index.html is also here so if for some reason when we are doing long project what you usually do we make a separate folder for css and we make the css file inside this folder okay so now i have a html file in my root folder and have a separate folder in the same folder for only css and my css file in this folder so if i only come to my then now you can see that the style has been gone what could be the reason the reason is right now it is calling from the root folder but our css is not in the root folder not in the same folder like the html so we have to link it with the folder name so in that case first so there will be href double quotation or single quotation both works first give the folder name if your css is in the folder then give the server slash then give the file name now you can see that i am using visual studio code it is suggesting me already the file name so if you are using visual studio code this is much easier so please use visual studio code so it will make your life easier so i'll give css forward slash style.css the folder name and please do check how it looks when i will click the save button you can see the text become red and also the text become red and also the text align is center so if i make it blue this will also work right and another thing is sometimes your css is not working because you are doing some mistake of giving the css like you can see i give a color and i give a colon here so when we are, i have i am also a beginner what i usually do i give a space between the colon so if i give a space between a colon and if i hit save you will see that if i space save you will see that the css is working in that case okay css is working 
Okay, now, now this is not a matter. So one, one issue I am showing is if I give a font size. Okay, so font size. So we can give font size in pixel. So like, like 60 pixel. And if I hit save, you will see the text will be bigger. Right? But if for some reason, when I was a beginner as well, what I usually do, after 60, I give a space. Okay, so if you give a space after 60, and if I save now, you will see that it will not work anymore. So you can see the text got smaller. So if I remove the space and again it save, it will get the 60 pixel. Okay, so there is two things. First of all, please, please make sure your CSS is linking properly and you should ideally link it inside the header. Okay, and with, with the link tag. And remember the link tag should open and should close. And you should have a href with singular double quotation equal sign with the appropriate CSS file name. So if for mistake, if you add the name with styles and did not give the dot CSS name, then if I give it styles and save, you'll see that CSS will not work anymore because the file name is wrong. Okay. And also another thing you should remember is that another thing you should remember is that if you are having your CSS in a separate folder like this one, then you have to call the folder and connect your CSS file as well. So if you have the CSS file in your folder and you are just doing like this style.css, then the style will not load. Okay. We have to give a CSS, the folder name, then forward slash, and then the file name, then it will work. So these are the main issue that your CSS file is not loading or not working. So I hope that helps. If that helps, please smash the like button and let me know in the comment as well. Thank you very much for your time.